on August 12th, 2025. Microsoft rolled out the cumulative update KB5063878 for Windows 11 24H2, a release that was meant to deliver essential quality improvements and critical security patches. But soon after installation, disturbing reports began to emerge from Japan and spread across global forums, highlighting that this update may actually trigger serious SSD problems, raising alarms for professionals, gamers, and casual PC users alike, as the issue seems to specifically occur during the Transfer of large amounts of data, where reproducible errors appear while writing to certain SSDs with particular controllers, leading in many cases to catastrophic data loss, because the error pattern observed is that affected SSD drives suddenly become unrecognizable to Windows 11 24H2, with SMART values completely unreadable leaving users unable to monitor drive health or even access their files. And while in some rare scenarios, users can still see a buffer directory structure of the drive, attempts to open or copy those files fail, making recovery next to impossible without third-party tools. And what makes this problem more alarming is that it does not occur randomly but consistently after heavy workloads, with reports indicating that once SSDs reach above 60% utilization, the bug manifests when approximately 50 gigabytes or more continuous write operations are performed, a scenario very common for video editors, gamers installing massive titles, or businesses handling large data transfers. And independent tests conducted by Japanese users have suggested that FISA NAND controllers are particularly vulnerable, with models lacking drum cache appearing even more susceptible, failing at smaller workloads compared to their drama-quick counterparts suggesting a deep compatibility issue between the Windows update and these SSD architectures. And this aligns with technical speculation that the update may have inadvertently introduced a firmware-level conflict in how Windows 11 24H2 communicates with specific SSD controllers, especially under sustained data-heavy conditions, making this not just a minor bug but a potential data integrity crisis for anyone running mission-critical systems with early affected users reporting drives, disconnecting mid-transfer, corruption of files, and in the worst cases, complete inability of the operating system to redetect the SSD until a full format or external reflash of the firmware performed, which of course, results in total data loss, a nightmare scenario for enterprises and individuals alike. And while Microsoft has yet to issue an official acknowledgement or patch fix, the user community is warning others to either delay installing KB5063878 or to ensure they have a full system backup before applying it, especially if their storage relies on FISN-based SSDs, a category that includes many budget and mid-range models used widely in laptops, desktops, and even external drives, and although higher, end models with drama appear slightly more resilient. The risk remains present meaning no one is entirely safe until an official patch is released, and already there are discussions on Reddit, Japanese forums, and Twitter threads listing potentially affected SSD models, urging consumers to check their hardware specifications before applying the update, with some even suggesting temporarily pausing Windows update until clarity emerges, because losing precious data, such as work files, photos, and... Videos is far too high a price to pay for a routine cumulative update, and this incident once again raises critical questions about Microsoft's quality assurance processes for Windows updates, as this is not the first time an update has caused major device malfunctions, reminding us of past issues with printers, audio drivers, and even blue screen errors caused by faulty patches. But this case is especially concerning given the permanent damage it can inflict on storage hardware, and as the situation develops... Experts recommend affected users rely on cloud backups, external HDDs, or NAS devices for critical data until stability is restored. Because SSDs that fail in this manner cannot simply be recovered with basic troubleshooting, making the risk far greater than usual update-related annoyances. And if you are running Windows 11 24H2 on a device with a fizzing controlled SSD, especially models without DROM cache, extreme caution is advised as skipping this update temporarily could save you from devastating data loss. And it will be interesting to see how Microsoft responds in the coming days, whether with a hotfix, rollback, or firmware collaboration with SSD vendors to resolve the compatibility issue. But until then, users should stay vigilant, watch official support channels, and most importantly, ensure backups are current. Because once your SSD fails under this bug, 
Recovery is unlikely, and that makes KB5063878 not just another routine Windows patch, but potentially one of the most damaging updates in recent memory. A cautionary tale reminding us that even in 2025, trusting automatic updates blindly can come at a very high cost. So make sure you stay updated with the latest developments here on Techverse.